Dear friends, this week we're learning about Abraham and the beginning of Jewish people. Abraham the Yivri, a person from another side. This Torah portion is called Lech Lecha, go to yourself. The longest journey is between your heart and your mind. Lech Lecha, go find yourself, find your purpose, find your meaning, find your calling. Abraham and Sarah were older people, yet God promised that they will have a son, a descendant from whom a nation will come. And that is exactly what happened. A miracle has happened, and they had a son named Isaac. Our nation begins with a miracle. The miracle of Jewish people can be seen and is discussed by many people that have lived throughout civilizations. And therefore, we praise the fact that Abraham, the first person, saw and heard God. He verbalized the idea of oneness and he taught it to people of his generation. We are descendants of a person who was not necessarily looking for popularity. He was on the other side, but he was looking for an authentic and real connection with God. He went inside himself to find the true meaning of what it's like to be a Jew, to be an authentic, to be real, to be a person that will be bringing monotheism and very deep and global ideas to the world. And today we still live by those standards. Today the Constitution of the United States is very much based on what Abraham introduced to this world. I would like to share with you a story about a king who was looking for a prince for his daughter and therefore he gave everybody a seed and asked that they should come back in a pot with a pot in a year and show what grew. The most beautiful flower would win the price of a princess. In one year time, the princess came back with beautiful flowers. Only one came with an empty pot. He was asked, what is going on? And he said, I tried my best. I toiled and toiled day after day, but nothing grew. The king turned to that prince and said, you are authentic, you are real. You're not a fake. You're not settling for fraudulent ideas of this world. You stand for truth. Every single seed was boiled. Nothing could grow out of it. Everybody substituted a seed with something else, with some ism of the society. You are the only one that did not bring flaw into this world. You stood for truth. And therefore, of course, that's the one that was chosen. We Jewish people have to represent truth. We have to be an example to our own people and to the people of this world. Have a wonderful, meaningful, and authentic week ahead.